Hello Associates! Welcome back to my channel. I'm John, a social entrepreneur and an ad strategist helping lifestyle brands attract customers online through Facebook and Instagram ads. Today, we're going to talk about how to set up properly your pixel. And of course, we need to make the pixel first before we set up it using um, the ads manager so as you can see right now we are in the ads manager interface we just need to click that all tools um, icon that hamburger icon from the left and then we just need to go to the business settings after going there click data sources and then pixels okay right now we have already created uh, the pixel but I'll demonstrate to you how to create one. Click add. You name your pixel. And then this is optional. You can put your website URL. And click continue. Earlier we have already created. So this is the pixel that we have created. We just need to continue the setup. Okay. So after you click that create button, you need to continue the setup. Right now, I'm going to be going to the events manager. And then I will continue the pixel setup. So I have, I have here two connection methods. Okay. Number one is through conversions API. And number two is through Metapixel. Now, for the purpose of this video, uh, the scope of our discussion would be uh, the setup through Metapixel. We'll be creating another video for the conversions API. Okay, so click Metapixel, click Connect, and right now we have two options here. We have manually add pixel code to a website. Uh, basically, here you might need to have a help with a developer, or maybe you have a, a, a knowledge already about coding, so you might want to install code code manually you just need to input this or insert this in the header or footer section usually header depends on the on the website um, there's also a partner integration here which is the easiest way and actually the most convenient way for for all and for this example by the way we are going to install pixel to wix.com Okay, Wix is commonly used for some brands and some businesses that would like to have a, a website that ha that's based on a template already. So, hindi na sila, uh, you'll not have uh, difficulty anymore on, you know, coding and setting up the WordPress. So, there are already um, available templates that you can use. So, just need to click Use Partner. And then, as you can see here, there are a lot of partners of Facebook or Meta in the installation of the Pixel. So, the usual ones here are here, this one, Shopify. We have WordPress. We have WooCommerce. We have Squarespace, which I use personally. And we have Wix. Okay. We click Wix. Okay. And there are several instructions here we will just follow it as we go along okay so if you have a uh, separate device that you want to use then you may do so so you can just follow what i am doing just like our past videos okay so if you're gaining something here if you're learning something please make sure to subscribe and also like this video to hype up the algorithm and also comment your questions so I could have some ideas for our future uh, content. Okay, so as you can see here, this is a guided um, instructions for you to set up your pixel with your uh, Wix. So basically, we are connecting our Wix account to Meta or Facebook. Okay, so the first step is to select marketing tools from the left menu. Okay, we will just split the screen. Right now, we're on the Wix uh, platform. We have already logged in to our um, account. 
we need to click marketing tools we need to find it here in this in this dashboard of wix we just need to go to our specific site okay let's select the site and then we're going to find marketing tools as i said here okay marketing tools mm -hmm. i think this is it marketing and seo Okay, now let's go to the next step. Select marketing integrations. Marketing integrations, we see it here. There you go. And then next, select connect in the Facebook pixel tile. Okay, we can see it here, Facebook pixel. Next, select connect Facebook pixel. So, we first need to... Uh, connect the pixel facebook pixel okay then the business manager yes and then we need to select the pixel here we need to find the pixel i'm going to find it and i just need to click continue next now it's linking wix to facebook There you go. It's done. Now we need to click next. Here. Okay. So as you can see, it's now connected. So we copy and paste the pixel ID. This is the pixel ID. Okay. But as we can see here, when we click view, there's nothing else that we need to do. Where, well, actually, we need to verify the domain on Facebook. We're going to make it in the next video. So that will not be a part of the scope of uh, this particular video. But we can see that there is a need to select and uh, specify the pixel ID. So we just need to click Next. Then right now, let's try. Okay. Let's send test traffic. There you go. So as you can see this, I want you to focus your eyes on this. Facebook Pixel Helper. So I downloaded it. When you go to Google, you just type Facebook Pixel Helper tool. Okay. Click this. You download the extension to your Google Chrome need to have a chromium okay so google chrome brave um, i think this is also available in the firefox so just install that and you will see this icon when it has a color blue not gray and then it has the number here like for example this one two so meaning there's an active pixel installed already okay so in the next video uh, we're going to talk about how to set up, okay? I mean, how to verify the domain. Because another step of, you know, running um, ads on Facebook uh, with a website um, as part of the mitigation on the iOS 14 update, if you knew about it, we need to verify our domain. Okay, so in the next video, I'm going to talk about it. So make sure to subscribe and also hit the notification button so you will be notified in the future videos. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.